Hello everyone. There may never have been another intelligent, technologically advanced alien species in the entire history of the universe. When you take into account that there may be 400 billion stars in the Milky Way, up to three potentially habitable worlds in many of these star systems, and some two trillion galaxies in the entire universe, it seems like intelligent life is an inevitability. Today we're going to show you mysterious repeated radio signals coming from galaxy 1.5 billion light years away. Let's get it on. Scientists have spotted repeated blast of radio signal coming from deep in space, the breakthrough is only the second time scientists have seen such a repeating radio burst. It both deepens the mystery and offer a potential opportunity to finally understand what might be throwing out the burst from a galaxy billions of light years away. Fast radio bursts have been speculated to be the result of everything from exploding stars to transmissions from aliens, but they have remained entirely mysterious, with little evidence at all of where they might be coming from. The flashes only last for a millisecond but they are flung out with the same amount of energy the sun takes 12 months to produce. Probably most exiting of the new bursts is one that scientists saw repeat six times, apparently from the same location, of the more than 60 fast radio bursts detected so far, only one of them has ever repeated. Ingrid Stairs, a member of the CHIME team and an astrophysicist at UBC said. Until now, there was only one known repeating FRB, knowing that there is another suggests that there could be more out there. And with more repeaters and more sources available for study, we may be able to understand these cosmic puzzles where they're from and what causes them. Seeing two repeating signals probably means that there exist, and that humanity will probably find a substantial population of repeating signals. The researchers write one of the two papers published in Nature, having two sets of repeating bursts could also allow scientists to understand what distinguishes them from single bursts, helping them understand more about the source and watch for future blasts. In all the researchers spotted some 13 of the bursts in just a three-week period, offering a vast new trove of data for the scientists hunting for their source, together they could offer some evidence of the extreme or unusual environment they are coming from or the mysterious technology that some claim alien civilizations could be launching them into space with. Team member Aaron Naidu of McGill University says, whatever the source of these radio waves is, it's interesting to see how wide a range of frequencies it can produce, there are some models where intrinsically the source can't produce anything below a certain frequency. The blast were discovered the Canadian hydrogen intensity mapping experiment in British Columbia, some scientists had worried that the range of frequencies it can pick up would be too low for it to receive the FRBs but it found far more than expected, and scientists expect it to identify even more. Of the 13 new blasts that were picked up, at least 7 of them were recorded at 400 MHz the lowest frequency of any yet discovered, that suggests there might be even more of them, too low to be picked up by CHIME. We now know, the sources can produce low-frequency radio waves and those low-frequency waves can escape their environment, and not too scattered to be detected by the time they reach the Earth, that tells us something about the environments and the sources, we have it solved the problem, but it's several more pieces in the puzzle, says Tom Landecker, a CHIME team member from the National Research Council of Canada.
Thanks for watching. Please subscribe the channel, like and share the video in social networks and we'll be right back to you as fast as we can.